the important thing i want to tell you is both partial and total knee replacement will give rise to complete uh, uh, cure of the pain there won't be any pain after that Hello everybody, I am Dr. Thadi Mohan. I am one of the orthopedic consultants in the Amrita Hospital, Kochi. Uh, I specialize in knee problems. Uh, I do a lot of knee related surgeries like sports medicine arthroscopy, joint replacements and I also take care of fractures all around the body. Amrita hospitals, uh, they are the first in India to acquire the Mako robot. So we are able to do total knee replacement, partial knee replacement and total hip replacement with robotic arm assisted technology. So many of these young uh, men and women who are there, who are in their 20s uh, and early 30s, we find that an MRI scan shows ligament damage. So there is something called an anterior cruciate ligament in our knee, which is frequently torn whenever you're involved in contact sports. This we are seeing also in high school students who do a lot of long jumps and uh, high jumps, uh, they can also tear their ligament if they land awkwardly. But it's very common, especially after football. Now, the good thing is, we can easily treat the ligament tears. And we have a very good arthroscopic division in Amrita hospitals. We perform keyhole surgery called knee arthroscopy by which we can reconstruct the torn ligament and the young sportsman or young sportswoman can be back on their feet the very next day. Uh, but of course, they need to go through a system of exercises to strengthen their muscles and wait for the ligament to take up so that they are back to playing sports in about six to nine months after the surgery. The next age group which we frequently see with knee problems are people called weekend warriors. Nowadays, a lot of people want to do cycling, walking, jogging. These are the people and also the housewives who frequently twist their knees and they can tear their menisci. The meniscus is a shock absorber within the knee joint which can tear and give rise to a lot of pain. Again, we can treat them very well with keyhole surgery uh, and nowadays there are other injections available like uh, platelet rich plasma, PRP and bone marrow injections for partial tears of ligaments and for meniscal partial tears as well. The third group of people are in their 50s and 60s. These are the patients who are developing arthritis in their joints. So arthritis can be total or it can be partial. We have the best technology in Amrita hospitals by means of which we can do a very good partial knee replacement if only half the knee joint has been worn out. This is very possible by means of the robotic surgery, the, by means of the robotic technology that we have readily available here. If the knee is completely worn out, then you have to undergo what is called a total knee replacement. The important thing I want to tell you is both partial and total knee replacement 
will give rise to complete uh, uh, cure of the pain. There won't be any pain after that, and the patient is able to lead walking. They can do light jogging. They can do swimming, and they can do cycling. People are unnecessarily worried about knee replacements, but what they should understand is the quality of life will drastically improve once you have a replacement. So, I would encourage more and more people to come forward, not suffer in silence, but come forward, meet your hospital doctors, discuss with the orthopedic specialists, and uh, get your problems solved. However, whenever we do a robotic surgery, in addition to the x-rays, we are also uh, doing a CT scan of the patient's limb so that we can plan the whole operation by constructing a 3D model of every patient's knee or hip. The advantage of this is that we can plan the exact size of the implant to be used, the precise position of the implant and exactly like we have made the plan, uh, the ditto surgery is also done so that the result overall is much more precise, much more sophisticated compared to a manual surgery. In India, it has only just come in and to date we have uh, only three robots in the country. The first one being in Amrita hospitals. We have performed more than 350 cases successfully uh, with very excellent results. Now the general feeling is that it is uh, very costly and not accessible to the common man but I want to assure you that that is not the case. Amrita hospitals are a big center for robotic surgery, be it in uh, uh, abdominal uh, urological or gynae procedures, as well as in cancer treatment. And in Southeast Asia, they are a big training center for robotic surgery. So keeping that in mind, they have kept the pricing for robotic joint replacement very accessible to the uh, common man. Can we completely avoid arthritis? No, we can't because arthritis as in uh, degenerative arthritis or osteoarthritis as it's called is an age related problem. It's related to increasing age. So as long as we are getting older, our joints are also undergoing wear and tear. So that cannot be entirely avoided. However, we can keep ourselves active by regular walking uh, and people who are more uh, sporty can do things like jogging, cycling, swimming. But simple walking, doing regularly will solve a lot of your problems. Most important of all is regular exercise of any sort, be it just walking in your neighborhood or uh, a, a light jog uh, or playing a game of shuttle, but do it regularly and that is how you can stay fit and keep your weight in check.